Oh, we like to multiply. Multiplying. Multiplying polynomials. Polynomials. Thirty-six times twenty-four is not a polynomial, but I could, I could make it one. Let let me think here. Uh, I'm going to let x equal ten because. We are using base 10. Base 10, so we'll let x equal 10. Well, you know, just this sort of type. Okay, so if x is 10, then I have three 10s, so 3x, and a 6. And I have 2x, two 10s, so 2x, and a 4. And I'd like to multiply these together, so I need a multiplication. That box is not big enough. Multiplication table needs to be a little bigger. Okay. I have a big multiplication table. Uh, no, no, that's just a box. All right, so I need to draw me some lines. I have two terms in each number, so I need two, two spots for each one. Hmm. All right, 3x and 6 go along the top, and then the terms 2x and 4 go on the side. So I have each number on each side. All right, so I'm going to fill out, fill out the multiplication table here. Uh-huh. Yep, 3x times 2x is 6x squared. 2x times 6, 12x. 3x times 4. Mm, yep, that's also 12x. Super. And, of course, uh, 4 times 6, I learned this. It's, um, oh yeah, 24. Okay. Multiplication table is filled out. Then I want to add up all my like terms. Add what I can add. So let's just go ahead and... Let's get these out of the box. I've got my 6x squared and my 12x and my other 12x and the 24. I need to, I need to add these up. But um, yeah, not like not like terms. So I should like separate these. The 12x and the 12x are like terms. So I'll line those up. 24 just put to the side. I'm gonna add up my like terms. Okay, 6x squared. And I got nothing to add with that. 12x and 12x. Oh, yeah, 24x. And bring down the 24. Okay, so I added up all my like terms. I'm, I'm missing something, though. These are, these are positive numbers, so they would be added together. Right, right, so I multiplied those together, but it doesn't really give me what 36 times 24 is, but... Mm, um, oh yes, x is 10. So I can, I can just put that back. x is 10. So 6 times 10 squared plus 24 times 10 plus 24. So I just put the 10 back where the x was. 10 squared is 100. So I get 600 plus 240 plus 24. And of course, 36 times 24 is... For sure, 864. Now, this, of course, assumes that x is 10. I'm working with base 10, but if I just left it as a polynomial, then 3x plus 6 times 2x plus 4 is 6x squared plus 24x plus 24. I can't know that x is 10 unless I told you, which this time I did, but... Maybe next time I won't.